I apologize in advance. Aww. All right, everybody, sing happy birthday to my son, please. Come on, it's his birthday. Thank you. Thank you. Happy birthday. Thank you. Happy birthday. Your mother's freaking insane. Right, haters. Time yeah, to his start. name is Nicholas. I'm sorry you have to deal with this one. Hey, Nicholas. I really do. Yeah, well. Oh, well. Everyone's got crazy parents. Are you Jewish? Yeah, I am. Okay, I have to stop everything I'm doing. Oh, whoa! Here. Oh, no! That's a good compliment. Oh my I just got through talking to a Jew. She's really sweet. Listen. I'm Jewish. Okay. Every, every Jew reports to the front. Hey, come here, Abby. Come on. Come on. Come on. No. You got those in your ears. Okay, listen. I'll join you. The Bible says the gospel is for the Jew first. That's right. Okay. First. Hey. First. 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 You hear that? First. Number one. Like FSC. First. First. <laughs> Number one, bitches. Number one. Yes, you're a very nice, uh, nice person. I'm sorry, okay, now listen, not. Jews. <laughs> listen up. Yeah, listen up. Yeah, for real. Yeah. Listen, Jews. Right, listen, so. Jews. Jesus Christ is your king. Huh? Jesus is the king of the Jews. Nah, nah, it says right. that no. on his cross. On, his, nah. on the cross of Yeshua, said king of the Jews. Written that's by why, the Romans that's to why mock they him. shoved a crown on his head to mock him. Can I? Can I? Can we officially call you queen of stupid people? Because I want to call you that to mock I'm you. Very that's smart. what they did with Jesus. Listen. I went to Israel. No, ignorance and hate like they should not be allowed in a modern society. You're the bigger hater than me, big guy. Yes, I'm bigger hater. You're bigger Hater. Hey, no, you're, you're a fucking saying. asshole because oh, you're Jewish. I'm you're sorry. Oh, hey, I love the Jews. I'm a total hater. Well, I'm, I'm, just like, I'm just trying to listen to what hey, she has to say. No anti-Semitism in my church, that's sir. Right. No anti-Semitism in her sir, church. That's right. right. This is my church, and we pray for the peace of Jerusalem in my church. Right. Matter of fact, I'm going to do that right now with you. All right. There God, we go. ask you to uh, touch the Jews in Israel and uh, bless them. Bless Bless them today as they're at the wailing wall praying for their Messiah. I pray that they have a revelation that Jesus is their Messiah. And I pray for the peace of Jerusalem. Because the Bible says there's a blessing. It's in the book of Psalms. There is a blessing for those that pray for the peace of Jerusalem. Is that the only reason you pray for Jerusalem? No, I pray because they're God's favorite people. Uh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> they are. They're the apple of God's God eye. Sure that's why if America so turns down. their back on Israel, watch and see if uh, America doesn't get in big trouble. Yeah. Okay, so... You know, uh, Jews are, are uh, smart people, too. They're very smart. Uh, they also uh, are good with money. Not me specifically. Okay. It's good with money. It's good with money. What else are Jews And uh, they got some bagels. I heard they oh, make pretty so good bagels. Good. <laughs> so good. Huh? You like their yeah, bagels? Hey, when I was in New Jersey, I asked the kids at Rutgers, what should I eat? And they said, oh, you got to have a New Jersey uh, bagel. You got to have our bagel. Yeah. You got to have our bagel. Well, so uh, there's a lot of Jews at Rutgers, but I uh, went to Israel this year because of the blood moon. Does everybody know what a blood moon is? Can I ask what's a video? I have a YouTube channel. Oh, wait. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What's the link? What's the link? Right, what's the link? Like Everybody wants to Not that I put everything on this. I, I edit like crazy. No, so you edit yeah, when I'm you're like wrong out. So that you can sound I, right. Can I, no, but then it's Angela videos. Cummings. Okay. Oh, I think I've seen All right. this now before. You probably have. I've seen your I'm jail. famous. <laughs> it's really, really freaking stupid. No. Okay, I have a video called How to Live in Your Car, but that's not going to help you get to heaven. No. But it is one of my number Dude, one videos. If your now, the idea of heaven is what you're preaching, I don't want to go to heaven. I'm saying that. This like year, April 15th, October 8th, the moon turned blood red. Next year, the moon turns blood red two times. It's called a tetrad. And 
And uh, there has not been a tea trad of four blood moons since 1967 when uh, uh, the Jerusalem uh, war happened. And then before that, when Israel became a nation, there were blood moons. My point is, uh, when there is a blood moon, listen up, Juice, very important to you. Oh, listen up, all you Jews. All right. The Jews believe that when the moon turns red, that war and a sword will come to the world. How do you know that? Are you Jewish? It is in their uh, Jewish... Uh, Torah. Torah. Not in the Torah. It's in your... Uh, the What's the name of the book? Megillah. You should probably know. It's the other... Well, I'm a Christian. I'm not I'm not I'm Jewish, but... It's in one of y'all's books, uh, tradition books. You guys have a tradition book. Anyway, it's in there. It's in the tr tradition book that... Okay, so anyway, the Bible says... In the book of Joel, in the book of Joel, that uh, before the coming and the dreadful day of the Lord, that the moon would turn blood red. Now, you also find that in the New Testament, in the book of Acts, chapter 2. So I went to Israel because the Bible says Jews require a sign. So one of the signs to the Jews is uh, when the moon turns blood red. Now, I've already bought my ticket next year to go back to Israel for the fourth blood moon, September, I think, 27th. Now, I will be there preaching. If anybody wants to come hold my camera, come on. Uh, you won't get paid. <laughs> but, uh, but you can uh, help me preach to Jews. Now, um, I preached during Passover. Uh, Muslims come to my church services. They're welcome. Uh, they're there as well. But the gospel is for the Jew first, then the, the Greek. Okay? Well, God favored Noah. God favored Noah. So you, you, can have favor too. See, that's what we want. We want the favor of God. That uh, and how do you get the favor of God? You truly think that you become a child of God. I've been to 20 nations this year. Yes, I'm very favored. Preach hate are the ones very favored. Well, you're the one preaching hate. How am I preaching hate? I I anybody. I am talking about the love of God. God loves everybody. The love of God is in the cross of Jesus Christ. No, now, when I preach in death. Israel, I preach with a stuffed lamb. His name is Behold the Lamb. That's his name. I, uh, I baptized him in the River Jordan because John the Baptist baptized Jesus, Yeshua, your king, in, yeah, he's your king. In the River Jordan. Okay, now here's the kicker. When John the Baptist, Jesus cuz, when John the Baptist saw Yeshua, he said, Behold the Lamb of God. I'm also pretty sure it was God that said that. No, it was John the Baptist, sir. Look it up in the Bible. John the Baptist, John 1.20. 29 boys and girls John 1 29 so behold the Lamb of God why do I say that because the Jews uh, used to kill lambs for a blood atonement for sin now when Jesus came along hallelujah here's the good news Woo, I'm feeling the spirit when Jesus came along, John the Baptist was the forerunner to Jesus. And he pointed to him. That's
That's why I said I must decrease that he increase. Because now that Jesus is on the scene, everybody needs to quit following John the Baptist and start following Jesus. Here's the thing. Why? So I never asked Because he has the words of life. Where are you from? I think it was just Florida? Okay. You got a little bit of uh, uh, Europe look to you. I